So the chase final is next in. Two and a half miles again. 0 to 160 again. And a disappointingly small field again, really. Uh, let's take a look at them. Top shelf for Craig Beckwith at the top. Word is my Bond Super. Martin Leadham, Days Ballet Dancer. Darren Thompson, Lanelli Sultane, Thomas Rogers, San Vino, Stu Gray, Balo Clasp, James Shea, Caulfield, Alex Cherry, Monumental Madness, Paul Rhodes, Motley for Stu Gray, and Victorian Elfel for Thomas Rogers. So nobody mob handed this time. And one or two got a couple in. But again, the amount of qualifiers that we had for this, it's a disappointing turnout for the final. And away they go. And uh, Lanelli Sultane. It's just about the first to show. Word is my Bond Super in the stripes on the inside, though, is going to lead them into the first of the 14, I think. Word is my Bond Super, a dead heat winner last week. With a field very, very tightly packed as they make their way to the first. And there's probably only four lengths between first and last. And they will eventually get to the first fence. There it is. And all safely over it with Monumental Madness. Just the early back marker, but Lanelli Sultane has gone on now then into the lead from Victorian Elfel in second as they get to the second, and they're all safely over that one. Monumental Madness, a little ponderous at the back, but nothing to be too alarmed about at this stage of the race. They take fence number three, and word is my Bond Supers jumped up on the inside of Lanelli Sultane to take a share of the lead. Balo Clasp is third, then comes Top Shelf, and then Mutley after that one with Victorian Elfel. I mean, just drop back a little bit. Days Bally Dancer in the white sleeves closest to us as they take number four. Good jump there by Monumental Madness. Sees him go past the back two. Uh, toward Days Bally Dancer and Caulfield. But word is Mob on Super. That's now gone on into a clear lead. And is clear by two to three lengths to top shelf second. Then Ellie Sultane third as they take the fifth. The leader really attacked that fence and jumped it well. So too did top shelf. Jumping nicely these at the moment as they make their way towards the next. Word is more Bond Super the leader. Oh, in second place, top shelf, then Balo class. Monumental Madness has put in a couple of really good jumps and has now powered through into fourth place as they make their way past the enclosures and they'll take the fence. It'll be the last on the next circuit. Word is my Bond Super landed in the lead. Top shelf is second, and Monumental Madness is third, and Balo Clasp is fourth. Then Lanelli Sultane and Victorian Elfel together with Sam Vino after that one, and Caulfield on the inside. Days Ballet Dancer on the wide outside, and Mutley just the back marker. But no doubt thinking of some dastardly doings to get past everybody and win. As Word is my Bond Super continues to lead. Shelf for top weight, second. And Balo Clasp is third. And Monumental Madness on its outside, fourth. With Lanelli Sultane after that one. And then Victorian Elfel. Caulfield on the rounds is getting a little bit closer. And then Days Bally Dancer wide on the track. And the two Stu Grey horses have just dropped to the back of the pack. San Vino and Mutley. But as we said, they're only about 10 lengths off the lead as they get over that one. San Vino was untidy at the back and is now a little bit further adrift. Than he was, but Mutley jumped past top shelf, who suddenly just dropped back through the pack as they take number nine, and they're all safely over that one with Balo Clasp now coming to challenge for the lead. And word is my Bond Super on the inside, still just about holds the lead, but out jumped there by Balo Clasp and Lanelli Sultane. Coalfield's come off the fence, then comes um, Word is my uh, Monumental Madness, who's still there. One that's really making some good ground there is Mutley, and Days Bally Dance is trying to come around the outside. San Vino is also running on as they get over the 11th. They've got just three more to take then now, and it's three in a line. Balo Clasp, Lanelli Sultane, Word is my Bond Super. After them comes Days Bally Dance a Caulfield, Monumental Madness, then San Vino, Mutley and Top Shelf, Victorian Elfel is the only one beaten as they race down towards the final three fences in there, in the starters order six chase, final and over that one, Word is my Bond Super, jump best and goes on into the lead Word is my Bond Super, Lanelli Colt Sultane, Bailo Clasp, then Cup Top Shelf, is getting back into it again under a big weight, then San Vino, then Caulfield, they've still got two to jump and over the second last they go, Word is my Bond Super, landed in the lead, but Bailo Clasp is beginning to get up on the outside 
right side, Bailo Class with the weight advantage, folks, it's heading front, then comes the Nelly Sultane, San Vino, Caulfield, there's only a short run after this final fence, it's going to be down to how they jump it, Bailo Class, Word is my Bon Super, then Nelly Sultane, over the final fence they go, Word is my Bon Super, jumped in best, and he's in the lead, Word is my Bon Super from the Nelly Sultane and Caulfield, Word is my Bon Super takes it from the Nelly Sultane, Caulfield and top shelf, Bailo Class, and all the way back to Victoria and Elthorpe, and... Word is my Bon Super in his third season in the SO7 League picks up his biggest win with the Starters Orders Chase Final. Uh, that's a, another one in the bank for me, which is quite nice at the end of the season. It was a difficult start to the season, but we've picked up at the end. Word is my Bon Super, the winner for Martin Legal. Then any Sultane for Thomas Rogers was second. Caulfield for Alex Cherry, third. Bano Clasp for James Shea was fourth. And San Vino for Stu Gray was fifth.